I'm an author, so I sit at home all day and I work on my computer. And once a day I walk backwards and forwards to the post office. Now the man in the post office is very cute. <laughs> <laughs> I've got my eye on him. <laughs> and we have, a, we have a very flirtatious relationship, but he is a very happily married Muslim. <laughs> and his wife also works in the post office. Dar al Alam has been politically ignored for 50 years and continues to be ignored whilst we go on fighting violence with violence and horror with horror. So what we're saying is, if you're fighting violence, surely you need to support the Dalai Lama. So you meet your man, you have your little piece of card, and you put a tick if you like him, and a cross if you don't like him. And if you both put a tick, then you swap email numbers. And then it's next, three minutes, next. Speed dating, the disposable society that This we is live what in. is coming next. Isabel, thank you very much. <laughs> Pleasure. Obviously, I'd never recommend anyone coming here just to meet guys. I mean, we're here doing a project, so we're here working. But if I'd been here all week working, then definitely I'd have met loads of interesting people. And that's what I mean about environments. Ha ha! Ha ha! You see, it's all a question of knowing someone who knows someone who knows someone who knows someone. And then there you are, you're in. Not married means their wife knows that they're not married. <laughs> okay? <laughs> you laugh. C'est dommage. Oui, parce que il dit un homme sans femme, c'est une catastrophe. Un homme sans femme, c'est une catastrophe. So I think what I needed was a, a hand to pull me out of the rut I was in. And certainly um, Insight provided that. And then the concept of the comfort zone which I go on to explore in the book, which is if there's something that we feel uncomfortable about doing, then it's an interesting avenue to go into. Beagling? Yeah. So you want a no, garden left ringer that goes beagling? Yeah, and sort of shooting. Sort Shoot. of shooting? Mm. <laughs> I know. Guardian left winger shooting <laughs> It's not the hype and the glamour and all that that I find interesting, although I'm not against all that. Um, it's the fact that there's people here that are doing stuff that they really believe in and that they're committed to and that they're passionate about. That's what I find interesting. Against Afghanistan, we had a coalition, but against Saddam Hussein, at the moment, we're in danger of the USA and the UK going it alone. So what kind of, what kind of man would be mm. right for you? I don't really mind what he does in life, like you. I mean, I don't mind if he's a bin man to, or a businessman, as long as he's interesting and, and rich. And <laughs> <laughs> so you're in the independent film sector? Yeah. You make independent films and production? Yeah, but mostly casting, though. American films. Casting what, those, like, Iceman Meltdown 2 kind of... Uh... No, a, a, blo I have some, a lot of big block, but mostly, like, you know, star names on the... Uh, the big blockbusters and stuff. I think he's winding me up. So this isn't what I meant by a film environment. Strangely. What did I mean by a film environment? I just want someone to be there and to enjoy life the way I can enjoy life and the way I do enjoy life. Lovely. So that would be really nice. All right, thank you. Marie. Thank you, honey, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.